Good morning, farm friends. Welcome back. Yeah, it's been uh, it's been exciting around here for the last couple days. Just no, <laughs> it's been extremely dull actually. Very humid. Not a real hot, but very humid. I think that's what's uh, maybe affecting my all my joints and stuff. <laughs> but yeah, hey. On today's video, I have a picture of the baby Pidgey. <laughs> one so far. The other one's so little. Oh, can't get his legs under him and stuff. My dad thinks he's only um, consuming water, not the, not the food. And so, yeah, he's really worried about him. He doesn't think he's going to make it. Yeah, it's, it's, it's a very sad. Very, very sad. But that one, like my dad said, that one was the one that, because the second one, there was, excuse me, two that hatched. And one of the little ones that did hatch didn't make it. And then this little guy, he was coming out and my dad helped him a little bit. And he was able to get the rest of the way out of the, uh, the egg by himself. But he's so little, like my dad said, so little. But anyways, I'm going to pop that picture on here and then... We're gonna visit Turbo and stuff. Oh, I got a bee coming after me now. Look at there. There's the baby chick, the baby pigeon, guys. Now, that one's a good size. The other one he showed me, it's so little, I don't want to show you guys that picture. All right, you guys, go there's Turbo. He's chewing on a stick. Are you, you, do you have a stick? Oh, yeah. You gotta make me a, a, a shank. I call it a shank, because then he holds it in his mouth and runs, runs towards me with it and usually stabs me with it. Do you, are you making a new shank? Yeah, that's what you... Oh, oh no. Don't chew that. Don't eat that. Turbo, don't eat that. Let me have that. Let me have that. Let me have it. Let me have it. Let me have it. Give. There. It's gone. It's gone. It's in with the sheep. You can't get it. Sorry. So, did we check on all the other animals? Did we? Say yes. We said good morning to everybody. Huh. Huh. Yep. We did. Turbo and I. We said good morning to everybody. Huh. And now he's just, he's been down here for a while with me. Watered my flowers. How huh? we watered the flowers. But we got a problem with the flowers. I'll show you guys. Walk over there and show you. So, the thing that I have them in, the legs are breaking off. <laughs> yeah, so it's coming undone. You can see right there and down at this end. So, I got my flowers out here. I'm gonna see when my dad gets and up. when he gets up, I'll have him come down with, come down here with me, and maybe I can get the sawhorse underneath it in the middle, prop it up a little bit, and that way we can fix it, the ends on it. I think it just got too heavy with all those flowers. The sheep are down there eating. Yeah, that's I gotta do that first because they're so loud. Guys, all three of them just love the, the zucchini. I mean. I'm like, wow. I mean, I don't want to give it to him every day because I don't know if that's healthy enough for him to be eating that much of that. You know, everything's in moderation, you know. So today they're not, I won't be giving any zucchini to him. It's going to be going to the chickies. <laughs> so anyways, yeah, let me get Turbo up and stuff and we'll get started with everything else. All right. You ready to go up, Turbo? Yep, there he is at the top of the stairs waiting for me. Ah. <sighs> You want me to take off your collar? Huh? You gonna give it to me? There. Okay. You wanna kennel up? Wanna say good morning, everybody? Say hi. <laughs> okay, let's go kennel up. Come on. Okay, get your love in. Gotta get his loving in first. Huh? Gotta get that loving in, huh? But you've been down with your head on my shoulders and my lap and everything already. 
Okay, let's go kennel up. Come on. Come on. Let's go. What, are you not going to behave now? Kennel up. Come on, Turbo. He's going slow today. It's probably because I'm videotaping. <laughs> He's like, I'm going to go as slow as I can. As slow as I can. Yeah. All right, boy. You guys see this bull? All right, we'll see you later, okay? Yeah, he loves his pool. You see those two little monsters in that cage? Let's see if Theo will hop. Theo, do you want out? Do you want out, Theo? You want out? You want out? Will you want out? Yes, yes, okay, I'm coming. <laughs> see you. All right, come on out. Come on out. Say good morning. Say good morning. You gonna tell everybody good morning? Huh? Where are you going, Theo? You're taking off. Oh, well, Henny likes the thing. Huh, Henny, you like it, huh? You like being on video. <laughs> so, I'm going to try to catch it today. The other day, I was sitting on my lap watching the videos, you know, seeing how they were looking, and Henny was sitting on my knee. And, boy, she was like this watching them <laughs> and calm. And every time she'd make a little sound, she was making the sound back to it. I'm gonna, I charged up my old phone so that I can see if I can videotape her uh, watching it. It's the cutest thing. I'm not kidding you. It's just the cutest. All right. Good morning, lovelies. How are you? How are you? Good morning. Good morning. Oh, off they go. There's, I think, yeah, I believe that's June right there. I, I believe that is. I'm not positive. Hi. You gonna say hi? Yeah. And little man's just waiting for me to do something so he can attack me. Huh, little man. You just want to attack me, huh? Yeah, that's all you want to do. You just want to attack me sometimes, huh? You just, it, it's no fun if you don't, huh? Hi, honey. Hi. Hi. <laughs> they don't come out. I leave the cage door open sometimes. They don't even bother. But let's see up above. Oh. Well. So, Yeah. I got these two right here. Now, this they might come out of because it's like free range right out the door. But I do have a couple eggs there. Oh, you're getting my finger? I, I don't have worms for you yet. But there is one way over there, guys. She is uh, sitting again. I've taken the eggs out. They lay just a couple and off she goes sitting again. It just She just won't stop. But, yeah, I thought you guys like looking at these guys. I got to clean them today, huh? We got to clean you guys today. It's dirty in there. No, no coming out. Look at the two knuckleheads. Because the reason why she's up there right now, uh, uh, Theo, is because yesterday I put boy in there when I let out the other ones. Because I just can't trust him. I just can't, I can't catch him. So I'm trying to get him very, very tame to me, which he's getting that way. And I'm hoping, but anyways, he has some worms up there and that's why she was up there. So I'll show you guys. See how he turns around like that for me? He wants me to pet him. See, he's getting pretty tame. Pretty darn tame. Huh, you are, huh? He knows when he comes to me and lets me pick him up. I pet him and then I give him some worms, huh? Yeah, we're trying to get you to come to me, huh? So that way you can be let out again, huh? Huh, 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 dude, huh? Yeah, he's funny. He is funny. He's a cute little thing, though. And the monster wants out. She's she's having a panic attack. Huh, Miss Pearl? Are you having a panic attack? You are, huh? Yeah. And so is... I think this is Sylvia. I can't tell. Her and Cutie. Cutie Pie. I can't tell them apart now. Unless they're side by side. Oh. I thought I'd check on the gangsters, show you them. That's what my new name for them. Since it's three boys and one poor little girl. So, yeah. I got somebody that might just be interested in the two roosters. So, and then I don't know what I'm going to do with Martin. I really don't want to take him to the feed store. I'd like to have him go to a home. But it's been hard trying to find somebody. The little girl, that's okay. Like I said, I have somebody that will take her and buy her from me or that or I can put her always in with them you know I'll figure out something for her it's just I just don't need any more roosters I really don't but if anybody's looking for a rooster that's calm and mellow I tell you those Armani's are the way to go not Martin though he's a little nut 
but he doesn't hurt you. He's just a little nutty. Huh. Oh, well, that's enough of them, huh? So you guys can see, he's pretty mellow to me. I mean, he's getting to where he really likes me. Like, he let me just grab him and come right out. I just got to make him a few more days, maybe a couple more days, to where he just really will come to me and know I'm not going to hurt him. Then he'll, I'll let him out again. But the trying to catch him, that was just too much of a nightmare, huh? Too much of a nightmare, huh? He really likes being petted, so that's the good part. Huh, you do. And when you know I'll give you worms and stuff, huh? Huh, you, you'd like me, huh? That's what I'm hoping. All right. See, he gets a special treat and he knows it. He's like, okay, I like this. This is good. It's all a training process. Huh, boy, all a training process. But somebody's underneath me. <laughs> She's like, where's mine? See, I'll show you what I'm talking about. This one actually is Sylvia, and that one's Cutie Pie. But together, they are really, really hard to tell apart anymore. Except for Cutie Pie runs to me when she finds something. Oh, there's Cutie Patootie. Hi, Cutie Patootie. And she looks just like the boy, except for a girl. It's just hysterical. They are cute, though. That is just, this one just has the cutest little face. Talk. See guys. She watches herself on t on the thing. Is that Henny? Is that Henny watching herself? Yeah. She likes the full screen better. Sorry, Henny, I can't get full screen on this one. But isn't that cute? Who's that? Uh oh, there's the other chickies, huh? Oh. Yeah. Okay. You are just the cutest, Annie. You really are. Just the cutest. I can't help myself. I just love that little thing. Huh. These two just don't get it. I told them to move because I'm letting out the big chickens. When I open it up, they're going to run like crazy. I tell you that. Huh, you're going to run like crazy, right? Well, you know, Sylvia, now even. Get out of here, Theo. Go. Go. Go, Theo. Get out of the way. Back up, girl. Back up. Back up. Here they come. Watch out. They're coming. You better run. Theo, you better run. Come here. I'm going to put you up with him. Okay. Joel, you better get back where your cage is. Okay. And then he'll stay right here. I'll just pick you up in a minute. Okay. You can go clean with me in a second. Everybody took off on us, huh? You guys are just watching the dirt, probably, huh? Sorry. There they all are. They're all underneath. I'm sorry about that. Girl, like I said, do you want them to attack you? Do you want it? Yeah, I know they're not supposed to, but they still do. You know that. Especially Baldy. She can't help herself. Big Mama, don't even think about it. Back off. Back off, girls. Don't. The boy's back in with the girls. They wanted to go up there all over me wanting their, uh, their oh, you hear him? He thinks he's all that bad. He's back in with the girls. He's like, I'm happy now. I got my girls. His sissies and his mommies. <laughs> he's funny. He, he's getting better. He's getting better. There's old Baldy. What are you doing? Your hair's coming, your feather's coming back. But that's okay. I'll still remember who you are. The nutty one. You're like the cluckiness craziest one of all, huh? I mean, look, you just, you walk near her and she just, she just freaks out. Yeah. Oh no. You guys, I've told you how many times, get out from under there now. Go, go, no. I have to get the broom. Go. They just won't stay out of there. Leroy, I'm not kidding. I'm getting mad. I'm going to have to put fencing around there or something to keep you guys out. Go. Oh, you know what? As long as we're right here, we'll go and check in the kitchen. Well, we're in here. And uh, they're all nutty as a L ever. Yeah. So, going to have to put water in here today. Because I believe she's about ready to hatch. And... No, that one's not. But this one down here might be. Yeah, I think that's ready to hatch too. 
but yeah. So yeah, this crazy one here that attacked me yesterday, yeah, she's the one that, that's the picture of the baby. And this is the one that has the bitty baby up there, so yeah. Being good mommy, but just unfortunate circumstances, you know? Guys, I need to come in and clean too. So you can attack me all you want when I have to start cleaning. Because this is getting gross again. Yeah, I clean those bars off almost every other day, huh? You guys just get them too dirty, huh? Huh? They are pretty birds though, aren't they? Look at that one. He's just, oh gosh. Look, underneath. It's Baldy. No. Ooh, I don't know who it is. I'm going to get out there and get So I was right. It was Baldy under there. <laughs> With another one. Stupid chickens. Um, yeah, <clears throat> I put Henny, Penny, and Theo up already. And them, cause, like I said, they've been out for a while. It's already getting late. But um, <coughs> I'll show you where all the black ones have gone. Girls, I don't know if I'd be under that. That might collapse on you. Leroy, do you hear me? I, you know, that's probably the reason why I did. You suckers are digging under there lately. You undermine everything. They do. They're just crazy. And if you hear that rooster in the background, that's, that's Leroy's son next door. I'll go over there and show you guys them when I go over. All right. So here's their chickies. There's Floppy. And I forget what they call the big one. I can't, I'm terrible with names. But... I give them some feed. They get a little scratch. I think that's what they give them. That's what they left. So, and they have their other feed in the in the thing. But yeah. But I just found an egg in the pen. So somebody laid an egg out here. Yeah, I gotta clean your guys' waters too. Huh. Yep, I gotta clean your waters. Those three. Those are the copper morans. Those are the ones that'll be laying that dark, dark brown egg. Oh, I can't. I just, oh, I want them so bad. But I just don't have room right now. But boy, I'd love to have some of those with their monies. And then cross them. I, I think it'd be a beautiful chicken. I really do. I can't wait. Like I said, when there's, oh, those are going to be cool. Yeah, you guys like that? Yeah. <laughs> She's laying by the water. You guys gotta clean your water. I gotta clean it. Oh, we got a copper moran in the. No, that's the lace, the wind out lace. Oh, darn it. She's in there laying an egg. So, I'll just probably put this one in there and grab him when I come back tonight. I don't know if you guys can see her. Can you see her in there? Yeah, she's. She's in there laying. But yeah. Pretty cool. Yeah, there's their waters. Those are big suckers. They are a little heavy, heavier to flip over and uh, dump out. But yeah, they are awful cute, aren't they? Oh, they're all going in now because because they dumped the water. Okay, Casey, there was one peeking, peeking its head through. It's cute, coming in and out. Here's the kids' pumpkins. They're doing really good. Really coming up. Really, really good. Yeah. That's cool. They like that. All right, guys, I'm underneath their shade tree. <laughs> it's like, okay, this is perfect. Hot. Very humid. Not, 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 not to where it's hot, hot. It's just humid today. It was 59% when I was earlier over there doing my chickies and stuff. But, yeah. So, guys... Hey, give me that thumbs up. Subscribe if you have not subscribed. Definitely, definitely comment and share. I appreciate it. And guys, like I said, I'm hoping everybody enjoyed the, seeing that baby pigeon today. And hopefully I put that smile on your face. Made you giggle a little bit with the craziness of the clucking chickens. And definitely, though, put that warmth in your guys' heart today. All right, you guys. If you hear the humming, it's the bees in the trees. All right. Thanks.